You have to do at least 150 hours of study. Oh, you have to be kidding. No, I'm serious. The final exams are coming up. Tell her. Oh, she doesn't need a lecture from me. Oh, you got that right. I don't listen to lectures. That's the problem. It's so beautiful here. It's too hard to think of study. Water, shed and will, same as always. I really don't get the big deal. Thanks. Oh, come on. The sun's sparkling on the water. It's a gorgeous day. What's not to love? She's such a tourist sometimes. Guys, we have to study. We will, right? Yeah. It's good to see you guys. For you. Thank you. And as it happens, I got something really cool to show you. Wow, it's beautiful. It's the crystal we got from the moon pool rock. I copied the design from your necklace. I hope that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. So who's the lucky girl? Actually, you. Me? I kind of owe you. He always goes out of his way for other people. It's one of the things I like about him. <laughs> Better it's biceps. Hey, it all helps. <laughs> hey, I've been looking for you. Yeah, and? Well, I just want to talk. Saying, just leave it alone, all right? It's over. New necklace? Yeah, I got it from a friend. What kind of friend? Just leave it alone. It's none of your business. So it's a guy friend, but I can guess who. You're making a fool out of yourself. He's like this tall, into diving. What are you doing? I'm moving on, so should you. Yeah, I've moved on too, so just tell me his name. It might be a slow day, but you could at least make an effort. I'm writing up the bank deposits. I've reconciled the till and ordered more stock. Oh, right. Are you OK? You've been pretty stressed out lately. Yeah, I shouldn't be taking it out on you. You're doing a great job. We're a good team, you and I. Sit down, relax. You're so tense. It's Ricky. Again? You've got to forget about her. My shift's over soon. We, we could go for a walk on the beach. Does your brother talk about Ricky much? Will and Ricky? Some guy gave her a present, a crystal necklace. And I bet it was him. They're just friends as far as I know. Yeah, so everyone keeps saying. Maybe it's time to put her behind you. All she does is stress you out. Righto, let's get organised. I don't see what the big fuss is. It's just another dumb soccer game. Kim, this is far from just another game. This is the final. A glorious climax a to a season. silly chance. Screaming at the TV and totally distracted husbands. Obsessed more like. Where are you going? To have fun, Dad. You should try it sometime. But I, I thought we could have fun as a family in front of the biggest game in the world. Clear. Great. You brought all your friends to watch. Ah, uh, sorry, Dad. We're pretty busy. You know how it is in the school exam, so we're going to go study. Oh. We'll, we'll try and keep the excitement down. Have you gone through that chemistry stuff yet? Yeah, I have. Do you want my summary? Yeah. Ricky, do you want to look at it as well? Oh, all this study's doing my head in. I need a break. Oh, can we 
listen to something else, please. Are you guys recorded? No, uh, uh, no. No. Hey, Good song. I think it's just... <laughs> Ricky. No, don't change it. No, not that. Your necklaces. Take them off. Okay, put the crystals close together. Freaky things in our time, but this is just really cool. What happens if we let them actually touch? Uh, I don't think we should be doing that. We don't know what we're dealing with. Well, there's only one way to find out. I really don't think you should. I'm game. Let's do it. It could be dangerous. down to this. He shoots! The goalie dies! No! 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 Bella. Clear it? I don't get it. There's no power, but the fuse box is perfectly fine. So what caused the blackout? Where's Cleo? Cleo? Bella, snap out of it. Cleo? Cleo? What's going on in here? Uh, nothing, Mr. Satori. Nothing? What are you lot up to? Dad, I have no idea what happened to the power. What was that blue light coming from your room? It was light from my mobile. I was using it like a torch. That's an awful lot of light from a little phone. So, how'd the game go? I wish I knew. That light, that was like when the moon used to affect us. I don't get it. How could moonlight come from a crystal? I don't know. Somehow the crystals were still pure moonlight. OK, well, we need to be careful with these from now on. Yeah, they're powerful. Oh, come on. We can learn so much from these. What, like how to blow up someone's electricity supply? I think I'll take this one back until we know what's going on here. <sighs> Good idea. I wonder if there's more of these. We found the crystal about here. And this is where we found Will's torch. And if there was one crystal in the rock... You think there'll be more? There's an awful lot of rock here. I reckon. How are we going to find a little crystal in all of this? Good to see you keeping fit. How many curls have you done? 30. That's me done. Hanging out with those girls isn't doing you any favours. You should come back and train with me. It's history, sis. I heard you gave Ricky a um, present, some sort of crystal. Where'd you hear that? 
Oh wait, let me guess. Zane. So what's going on with you two? She's a friend. That's all. A really good one. That's it? Totally. Okay, I believe you. Any luck? Mm, not yet. We're wasting our time. This is too much rock to cover. I've got an idea. Give me your crystal. Now we know that the crystals are attracted to each other when they're really close. So we get close. Will and Ricky are definitely seeing each other. Well, you know that for sure. I'm trying to hide it, but he's my little brother. He can't keep anything from me for long. Right. I'm sorry, but it's true. You're being too timed. Uh, okay, I get the idea. You should forget about it. I don't want to. You're a good looking guy. Loads of girls would be interested in you. Let's go for that walk. It'll help you take your mind off things. I could make you dinner. Where are you going? Um, just hold the fort. I'll be back. Hey, fish boy! Fish boy! This is gonna work through rock. I mean, it's solid. It seemed like a good idea at the time, but hang on. Go, go back a bit and up. There, look. Ricky. You found it. Another crystal. And exactly like the others. I know, incredible, isn't it? So what does this all mean? I'm not sure, but we need the other crystal to find out more. Sure, it's right inside. Okay, we just need to get the two. Whoa. What? No. What is it? Oh, someone's been in here. How do you know? The necklace, I left it right here. Someone's stolen it. I just ducked out for a moment, I swear. I do it all the time. I should have locked up. Maybe you left it somewhere else. It was there, I'm sure of it. Well, is there anything else missing? I'll have to go through everything, but it doesn't look like it. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I don't want to be the one to say. I mean, Sophie. What? No, no, she wouldn't. Would she? She was asking about the necklace earlier. How does she know about it? Zane. That's who told her and that's who took it. Where are you going? To get it back. Well, wait. Yeah, let us come with you. No. This is something I have to do by myself. Hello?
Give it back. You figured that out pretty quick. I'm warning you. Not until you tell me what's going on with you and Will. Nothing is going on. No, I would have just given you one. What? And what happened to us? We, we really connected. You're forgetting all the bad stuff. Is that so wrong? Yes. You ruined it, Zane. Deal with it. I know I made some mistakes, but there's still a chance for us, isn't there? If we just got back together, things would work out. I know it. I can't just stop my feelings for you. And I know that you feel the same way too. Don't you? I can't believe that guy. Coming in here, stealing. What is she ever saying here? Come on. She wanted to talk to him alone. Ricky makes out she's tough, but deep down, she needs our help, whether she realises it or not. Well, I'll come with you. I don't trust that guy, and you might need backup. Thanks, but I think you being there might just make him worse. Yeah, it's okay. This is a girl thing. And think of everything we've been through together. I've always been there for you and your friends. And this place was supposed to be our thing, our dream, and without you. What about Sophie? What about her? We seem to have set her up pretty nicely here. She works here, so what? Oh, come on. She's into you. Can you honestly look me in the eye and tell me you don't feel the same way? Not a bit. I can't trust you anymore. I didn't do anything. You kissed her. It was nothing. I saw you and it wasn't nothing. You don't want to believe me. You're making up excuses so you can be with someone else. Oh, that's ridiculous. Let's, well, let's just go out and get something to eat and I'll give it back after that. No. You want me to leave you alone? Yes. Fine. But just know that's the end. I don't owe you anything. I don't want anything from you. Really? Because if we're apart, I can't guarantee I'll keep you secret. What? You heard me. I never thought you'd sink that low. You want me to be loyal to you. All I'm asking for is the same in return. Give me the necklace. What is so special about it? Is everything okay, Zane? It's none of your business. If this is about my brother, it is my business. Stay out of it, Sophie. Give me a crystal. Well, it seems you've got your nose in everyone's business. She doesn't know the half of it yet. Ricky! Ricky! What just happened? Nothing. And this makes three. Aw, thank you. It's beautiful. So, the three of them together... ...can probably black out an entire city. But why? We have no idea, but now we can figure out what's going on. I'm sorry about saying... You should have just let me deal with him. It's my business. Stealing that crystal made it our business. What if he'd given it to someone else? I don't think he would have. I think he was just trying to get back at me. We couldn't take that risk. Now he's really angry. What do you think he's going to do? The cafe is quiet today. Not in here. I have to get these orders done. You heard any more from Ricky? Uh, no. Pretty weird her turning up like that. You think? 
Yeah, I do. The electrician just left. He couldn't find a thing wrong with the fuse box. Go figure. You ever gonna tell me what really happened last night? Tell her we're mermaids. No. Ricky, wait. I'm really sorry. I said some pretty stupid things last night. I just lost my head. But, um, I'll make it up to you one day. I promise. I can't do this anymore. We need to know if we can trust you with this from now on. Of course. But I can never forget all the good times we had. I mean, can you? No. But I also can't forget all the bad stuff either. So until then, you're lucky I'm speaking to you, all right? <laughs>